racing on now with two and a half to go and Dames and Dimers has come under pressure against the rail as par joined by Fantastic Secret Twin Falls joins in on the outside in behind them final frontier Antelope Canyon Adelina looking for a split between them racing now towards the final 200 yards and in the center it's Fantastic Secret who's just the leader being pressed now on the outside final frontier comes to pick it up and final frontier and Shane Foley stretch on two and a half to three going away final frontier wins the opener for Shane Foley as per a second fantastic secret Adelina is fourth racing on now with two and a half to go and Dames and Dimers has come under pressure against the rail as par joined by Fantastic Secret Twin Falls joins in on the outside in behind them final frontier Antelope Canyon Adelina looking for a split between them racing now towards the final 200 yards and in the center it's Fantastic Secret who's just the leader being pressed now on the outside final frontier comes to pick it up and final frontier and Shane Foley stretch on two and a half to three going away final frontier wins the opener for Shane Foley as per a second fantastic secret Adelina is fourth racing on now just outside the two and Balmon Mass pushed along against the rail joined and just headed by Russian Soul couple of lengths to in third place Gordon Lord Byron line of reason trying to pick up on side your and test at last racing now to the final furlong Russian Soul Gordon Lord Byron and line of reason getting to them on the outside Balmon Mass battling on against the rail Gordon Lord Byron in front line of reason on the outside of Balmon Mass running up towards the finish it's Gordon Lord Byron driven out by Wayne Lorden will win for Tom Hogan Balmont Mast possibly just second line of reason and Russian soul is fourth racing on now just outside the two and Balmont Mast pushed along against the rail joined and just headed by Russian soul couple of lengths to in third place Gordon Lord Byron line of reason trying to pick up on side your and test at last racing now to the final furlong Russian soul Gordon Lord Byron and line of reason getting to them on the outside Balmont Mast battling on against the rail Gordon Lord Byron in front line of reason on the outside of Balmont Mast running up towards the finish it's Gordon Lord Byron driven out by Wayne Lorden will win for Tom Hogan Balmont Mast possibly just second line of reason and Russian soul is fourth racing on just outside the two and Mentry continues in front Misty Lane color blue Duchess and Doris sparkle factor military angel is next racing on now towards the final furlong and still Mentry leads from Misty Lane they're followed by color blue sparkle factor military angel makes ground Byzantium is towards the outside color blue now comes on the near side to just pick it up Byzantium and military angel racing between horses color blue all out military angel the near side in third place place was Byzantium and Mantry is next waiting the judge to call that one racing on just outside the two and Mantry continues in front Misty Lane color blue Duchess and Doris sparkle factor military angel is next racing on now towards the final furlong and still Mantry leads from Misty Lane they're followed by color blue sparkle factor military angel makes ground Byzantium is towards the outside color blue now comes on the near side to just pick it up Byzantium and military angel racing between horses color blue all out military angel the near side in third place was Byzantium and Mantry is next waiting the judge to call that one And as they come off the turn, Sovereign Debt on the near side of Fastnet Mist. They're being followed by Shepherd's Purse, Tennessee Wildcat, Flight Risk. After them is War Envoy and Elval. Sovereign Debt now goes for home, a couple of lengths clear. Followed in second place by Fastnet Mist. Shepherd's Purse is next with Tennessee Wildcat running up to the finish now. And Sovereign Debt is out clear under Chris Hayes. A long way in front. Sovereign Debt's going to score from Flight Risk to Fastnet Mist and War Envoy. Sovereign Debt by a long long way wins for Chris Hayes and trainer Dandy Nichols in the colors of Lady O'Reilly 
And as they come off the turn, Sovereign Debt on the near side of Fastnet Mist. They're being followed by Shepherd's Purse, Tennessee Wildcat, Flight Risk. After them is War Envoy and Elval. Sovereign Debt now goes for home, a couple of lengths clear. Followed in second place by Fastnet Mist. Shepherd's Purse is next with Tennessee Wildcat running up to the finish now. And Sovereign Debt is out clear under Chris Hayes. A long way in front. Sovereign Debt's going to score from Flight Risk to Fastnet Mist and War Envoy. Sovereign Debt by a long, long way wins for Chris Hayes and trainer Dandy Nichols in the colours of Lady O'Reilly. Towards the outside is Hurricane Cass. Racing on now past the two. Breathe Easy still in front. Stop and linger second. Lean and Keen. Hassanur in the centre with Bo Satchel. They're being followed on the outside by Captain Joy. Racing well inside the final furlong now. And Breathe Easy from Hassanur on the near side. Stop and linger is next. And Bo Satchel putting in a late bid. Hassanur now comes to join Breathe Easy and takes over. And runs to the finish. It's another one for Shane Foley and Mick Alford. Hassanur beats Breathe Easy. Bo Satchel is third. Close for fourth, I'll be our clown, lean and keen and stop and linger. Towards the outside is Hurricane Cass. Racing on now past the two. Breathe Easy still in front. Stop and linger second, lean and keen. Hassanur in the centre with Bo Satchel. They're being followed on the outside by Captain Joy. Racing well inside the final furlong now. And Breathe Easy from Hassanur on the near side. Stop and linger is next and Bo Satchel putting in a late bid. Hassanur now comes to join Breathe Easy and takes over and runs to the finish. It's another one for Shane Foley and Mick Alford. Hassanur beats Breathe Easy. Bo Satchel is third. Close for fourth, I'll be our clown, lean and keen and stop and linger. Racing now towards the final furlong and a half. On the stand side is Logout Island with Painted Cliffs right up on the outside. They're followed by Argentero and Rockaway Valley. Painted Cliffs now comes there on the outside to pick it up for Ryan Moore from Logout Island and Rockaway Valley and Argentero and running well inside the last 200 now. It's Painted Cliffs out in front being chased in second place by Rockaway Valley on the outside. But running up to the finish, it's Painted Cliffs and Ryan Moore will win it by three. Rockaway Valley, Logout Island and Argentero racing now towards the final furlong and a half. On the stand side is Logout Island with Painted Cliffs right up on the outside. They're followed by Argentero and Rockaway Valley. Painted Cliffs now comes there on the outside to pick it up for Ryan Moore from Logout Island and Rockaway Valley and Argentero and running well inside the last 200 now. It's Painted Cliffs out in front being chased in second place by Rockaway Valley on the outside, but running up to the finish, it's Painted Cliffs and Ryan Moore will win it by three. Rockaway Valley, Logout Island and Argentero. It's Storm the Stars with Jack Hobbs coming there strongly now in the centre for William Buick, being followed by Giovanni Canaletto. Kilimanjaro is next and then Highland Reel. They're racing now towards the final furlong. Storm the Stars and Jack Hobbs coming there on the near side now to pick it up in the Godolphin colours. And Jack Hobbs, runner-up at Epsom, has now storming to the front, gone three to four clear and racing up towards the finish. Jack Hobbs is going to run away with the derby, wins it for William Buick, John Gosden and Godolphin. Second home is Storm the Stars, Giovanni Canaletto, Kilimanjaro Highland Reel, and then qualify Carbon Dating and Radden Poor. It's Storm the Stars with Jack Hobbs coming there strongly now in the centre for William Buick, being followed by Giovanni Canaletto. Kilimanjaro is next and then Highland Reel. They're racing now towards the final furlong. Storm the Stars and Jack Hobbs coming there on the near side now to pick it up in the Godolphin colours. And Jack Hobbs, runner-up at Epsom, has now storming to the front, gone three to four clear and racing up towards the finish. Jack Hobbs is going to run away with the derby, wins it for William Buick, John Gosden and Godolphin. Second home is Storm the Stars, Giovanni Canaletto, Kilimanjaro Highland Reel and then qualify Carbon Dating and Radden Poor.
racing now towards the two. Hurricane Ridge pressed by Venezia. Winter Lion, awesome star on the outside. Silvana's gone for the gap between them. Venezia in the center on the far side, Hurricane Ridge. They're followed by Silvana, and on the outside is awesome star and Winter Lion. Hurricane Ridge still battling on strongly with Silvana, Venezia and Awesome Star. Head ahead as they go to the last 50 yards. It's Silvana on the near side, inching it on the line. Silvana and Pat Small and Hurricane Ridge clear of Awesome Star, Winter Lion and Venezia in fifth. Racing now towards the two. Hurricane Ridge pressed by Venezia. Winter Lion, awesome star on the outside. Silvana's gone for the gap between them. Venezia in the center on the far side. Hurricane Ridge, they're followed by Silvana. And on the outside is awesome star and Winter Lion. Hurricane Ridge still battling on strongly with Silvana, Venezia and Awesome Star. Head ahead as they go to the last 50 yards. It's Silvana on the near side, inching it on the line. Silvana and Pat Small and Hurricane Ridge clear of Awesome Star, Winter Lion and Venezia in fifth.